It was on Pancake Day, which coincidentally is the same day as me mam's birthday, so it's always a big day in our house. But on this occasion, me mam was out with a new boyfriend, Jeff. A butcher, he doesn't own his own shop, he's a supermarket butcher at Morrison's. So I went off for fishing just outside Billingham. I was tired because I'd been out in the bongo last night with Martin Carrick. So he tied his line to his dugo and he just laid there in the sun. He awoke to the tugging of a tiny little trout. I guess about seven ounces. Maybe eight, but that's a guess. So I whipped it out and stamped on it. It was smaller than I thought. Why do you do that? I heard from a voice just behind me. So I quickly turned and looked around and saw her standing there. Her most beautiful maiden with soft brown hair and golden eyes. Her skin was silky and so soft and he asked her to marry him. Oh, yes, she said, I will marry you. And the date was set for the 4th of June. And I stood up and I lamped her with a piece of her fence post. So she fell to the ground by the trout, the trout on the river bank. So we pushed them both into the river, just, just outside, outside Billingham. So I went back to me mam's house and did a drawing of the maid. But it came out looking like Rod Stewart, so I shot it in the bin. About a half an hour later, the CID turned up at his house. He offered them both a pancake, but the pair of them turned it down. It was a woman and a fella, she wasn't bad looking. And I thought just for a moment that I might lamp her as well. But the bloke copper was massive, about the size of Tommy Cooper. Yes, so I thought the better of it, and I let the feeling pass. Now I'm just sitting in my cell, here in Durham prison. Tomorrow I get sentenced. What a shitty pancake day.